G'day. We're on the uh, Burke Development Road at the moment. We left uh, Chilligo this morning and we've been travelling. Oh, hang on, little dust hole. We've been travelling uh, most of the day, well, it's lunchtime now, uh, most of the morning anyway. And uh, we're heading towards Normanton. I'm not sure if we're going to make it today. We might end up camping out here somewhere tonight. But um, it's uh, 560k from Chilligo to Normanton. And uh, probably, you know, 600 with little detours here and there. So it's a, a fair run and there's no fuel. <laughs> 600 kilometers, no fuel. So it depends on how many little side tracks you do. You're really going to be struggling if you haven't got a range greater than 600 kilometers. Towing the van, that is. Um, yeah, it's been a pretty good day so far. The track's not bad. Uh, we're in a section now, I have been for about 50 or 60 K. It's just absolutely dotted with uh, bulldust and I have a semi-trailer coming towards me. I'm just gonna pull over and let him pass. That's the sort of dust we've been having to put up with for most of the day. G'day guys, or girls, sorry I should say. Today we've pulled into a camp for the night on the Burke Development Road at uh, Staten River or Staten Creek maybe at the crossing. This is the bridge across the um, Staten River on the Burke Development Road and just a little way from where we're camping. Not a bad spot. Pretty warm out here at the moment. We've got a bit of a wind howling around but uh, yeah, it's not too bad. Check this out. There we are over there off the track. There's a uh, small dam between us and the road. I'm just standing out the road at the moment, so we're not that far off it. But far enough to be away from the dust. And yeah, there's these road train trucks that come through with four tippers on them, side tippers. And they stir up a shitload of dust. G'day, this is our campsite at uh, the Staten River, Staten or Staten River, I'm not sure how that's pronounced, but it's uh, pretty quiet here. It's on the Burke Development Road, probably a little bit more than halfway between Chilligo, Chilligo and Normanton. I keep forgetting Chilligo, we were there for four days, only yesterday. You reckon I could remember the name of the joint? Anyway. Yeah, we're only here overnight, it's just an overnighter. We're, uh, we'll be in Karumba tomorrow about lunchtime. That's the plan. We'll probably stick around there for a few days and then down to Normanton for a couple of days before we figure out our next moves.
morning. We just left our camp at Staten Creek from last night. Beautiful, peaceful night. Amazing sunset last night. Got some uh, time exposure of that, and that's pretty good. Sorry, it was a dip in the road. <coughs> um, yeah, really nice, peaceful, quiet camp. It's great. So what is it now? It's uh, 20 past 8 and we're back on the road towards um, Normanton, although we're going to Corumba. So there you go. We'll be at Corumba for the next three days and um, who knows from there. See you there. This is the Gilbert River crossing on the Burke Developmental Road on the way to Corumba and uh, Normanton. We've got a couple of freshwater crocs on this one. We'll see if we can get some pictures. There are a couple of uh, little freshwood cro freshwater crocs, probably about know, three or four foot long. Only small ones. But as soon as we approached, they took off and uh, jumped in the water. So we're probably not going to get any pictures. There's one over on that sand bar in the distance there. You can, we can see, but the camera probably can't pick that up. Put your marks in the sand where they've been. They didn't hang around for very long. Plenty of evidence of them. Bummer, we can't see one anywhere. There's a couple over on that sandbank over there. But uh, they've all taken to the water as soon as we walk down here. Corumba Point. I think it's the outlet of the Norman River. Check that one. And there's the Sunset Tavern. Good feed there. Happy hour, which is always pretty good. And uh, we sat in here last night and had tea and watched the sunset out over this bay here. It's beautiful. This is Corumba Point here this region and the town of Corumba's uh, down here and uh, we're on a sunset cruise tonight leaves about what 3.30 yeah. comes back about 7 and uh, taking the view in the tides in now well not completely in but it's in more than it was last night there was heaps of sandbars out there I can still see a couple Just making my way down to the uh, Corumba Point uh, boat ramp. Uh, this is where we have to meet the ferryman cruise tonight for the sunset cruise that we're going on. The, uh, what is it? Th three and a half hour cruise. Oh, hang on. Sounds like Gilligan's Island, doesn't it? A three hour cruise. Anyway, yeah, this is where we'll be uh, 
meeting them about 3.30 this afternoon. Looking forward to that one. Uh, this is the boat ramp at uh, Karamba Point. That's the Sunset Tavern there in the distance. Very, uh, very big boat ramp area. Karamba's Tree of Knowledge. Doesn't look like it's doing too well. 2014 that sign was put up. So they've had six or seven years to think about it. Board the Sunset Cruise down the Norman River in Karumba.